Hey guys, what's going on? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Well, sorry for the lack of videos uh, lately. I'm just not really feeling like doing too many videos. I'm still dealing with my back that's it's normal out self, but I threw it out a couple days ago doing something. And uh, yeah, it's not doing real well. So uh, I'm still working out, still walking, still spinning on the bike. But uh, it's nothing worth really filming and messing with. Unless you want me to document my horrible back life. But I won't do that. This video today is kind of about uh, working around a bad back. And I wanted to show you something. Now, of course, I'm not working out right now. This is just for demo. But uh, uh, having a bad back, sometimes squats are out of the question. But the good news is, is you can use a Smith machine that can help things out. And also, like I witness myself and I do myself, a lot of times you'll see me put my hands on my knees while I'm squatting to make sure that I'm giving my body something nice to rest on because, you know, I have a weak back. And so, uh, you know, you got to do what you got to do. But what I did this past Monday is uh, I used my bench and uh, it, it was just sitting here. And out of nowhere, I was just like, hey, let me do that. And so let me show you what I did. I'm sure you can guess. So you kind of make sure your bench is somewhere close to you. And you can, uh, and it's on an incline, like so. So you'll get up under your bar. Get like so. Again, this is just for demonstration, just something I, I kind of figured out. And uh, yeah, so a lot of times you'll see me put my hands on my knees when I go down and come up and it just gives me a nice solid base. Well, I figured if I can pull my bench up a smidgen, you can put your hands on your bench and it does the same thing, kind of. And, uh, yeah, anyway. And it gives you something nice to hold against as well. Uh, it can come up a little bit closer to me to make it a little bit more uh, normal where I don't have to stretch out too much. But the, uh, the tripod's kind of by the bench and I don't want to move it. So, uh, you get the idea. Uh, it's just a good way, uh, if you need some help, Stabilizing yourself while squatting. Yeah, it does a good job. And feels just as good, maybe better, than trying to, you know, hold your legs. So, well now I'm going to start working out. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, it helps out, guys. And uh, those of us that do suffer from uh, horrible back issues, uh, are all, we always need something to uh, maybe help us, you know, a little workaround or whatever. So that's a little tip for you, just in case you've never thought of it or tried it. So anyway, hope you get a little something out of the video. I hope to be back full swing pretty soon, but you know, there's a gazillion other channels out there you can watch, guys. Uh, to get a lot better content than what I'm giving you. So, don't feel bad by doing it. I do it. All right? <sighs> get up, get out, get ran, do it to it. And thanks for watching another quick episode on The Body Beatdown with me, Michael, your host. See y'all later. Take care of them backs. Get up, get out, get ran, and do it, do it!